a long distance relationship with PB and J. I don't want to more precious. Hey guys, it's Shraddha. In today's video, we are going to be pulling an all-nighter. Pulling an all-nighter. Now, all-nighters are not something that I've never done before. I mean, I have been doing this for years now. But today is a Saturday and I usually don't do that on weekends until unless I don't have something to do like some work to do or a video to edit. So this Saturday I'm actually editing a video and this particular week has been a little busy for me so I didn't get much time. I have to finish that so that's the main purpose of this whole video idea. Before I started making YouTube videos I never, never heard about what pulling an all-nighter is. I actually very recently got introduced to this term. I was not aware of this particular term of pulling an all-nighter and people do this. The thing that doesn't make sense to me is if you don't have a reason, why would you pull an all-nighter? Like, do it like a challenge? I'm not sure. So for me, pulling an all-nighter has a very specific reason. It's either I'm working or maybe I have a video to edit. That is the case for today. Uh, or there's another reason. So me and my soulmate, we are in a long distance relationship. We are miles apart, like in different time zones. So I mostly do these all nighters so that we are having that particular time frame where we can talk to each other or FaceTime or that's the only time we are able to manage to talk to each other. And that's probably how long distance relationships work. So going through a few videos on YouTube for some video ideas and I think this was something kind of interesting of how people actually try on pulling an all-nighter which is quite an easy task for me but I thought I'll make it a different sort of challenge and I'm not going to use my phone so I'm not going to be using my phone for pulling an all-nighter and let's see how it goes. So right now it's about to be 1 a.m. So about the video I'm editing right now, I'm halfway through it and I've been editing for a couple of hours. Because I had early dinner, I am kind of hungry so let's go and make something. I'm going to make a nice sandwich, maybe a... PB and J. So I'm gonna do that and uh, I'll be back with my sandwich and I'm gonna edit and I'm gonna see you guys.
Hey guys, halted the editing for a while. I have a few packages to open, so I thought, why not? Let's appreciate how much effort Nika puts in to deliver the product safely to us. This is not sponsored. Face and body best. I love this product. It's so pure and I think I've used a lot of these. This actually lasts very long. I use like four to five bottles of these. The first time I used this product, it was gifted to me by my very dear friend. You know who you are if you're watching this and I am so thankful to you for introducing me to this and next we have a few more products are uh, the products that I love and this is not sponsored so I have ordered these two both are cleansers from Kama Ayurveda I love this cleanser so much that I've ordered these but I already have like two of these let me get them I have two more right now so this one is like all finished I've used this up and the next one I have like it's halfway through it smells amazing and it's all Ayurvedic so these two I already have and I've ordered two more so I don't want to get like short on this particular product because it's my savior. So cheers to Kama Yuveda for making such fabulous products. I love their products a lot. And this is Nika Matte to Last. They last very very long. This particular shade I truly truly love. It's Bombay. So let's move to our next how cute this is like the packaging this lip balm i have never used and this is the first time i've ordered this this is tipsy lips moisturizing balm let's see how it is so much mangoey oh getting on to the edit and i will see you While I edit, I am constantly thinking of what to do next. Like I don't have something to do. I don't. I don't want to work. I don't want to do anything right now. I mean, with a cell phone, it's quite easy. You can scroll through social media and you can just watch a movie or play some songs. I don't know, without a cell phone it's kind of difficult because you actually don't have anything to do if you have to pass all these hours and so much of time. Right now it's 3.30 in the morning and I'm just waiting for it to be 5 a.m. and mama will be up so we both will be going for a morning walk and it's Sunday so it's gonna be a nice start the day and then later during the day I can sleep maybe. I love flowers, I like to 
buy them for myself and if it's gifted it's more precious so I don't feel like throwing these away I don't know if you have any idea of what you can do with these just let me know in the comments down below what I do is I just take these flowers out and then I take a book like this and then I put all those flowers in this so that they dry out some traces of those in this over here so these flowers are not completely dried out these are like semi sort of dried I think I'm good so I'm just going to close this now it's so beautiful and once they are all dried out they look actually really pretty I have a lot of them book closed so I think one activity is done now I have another task of thinking what else to do till it's 5 a.m.